Um, but today is a product review. And this is a very different product review. This is for my ladies. Like, no man needs to worry about this video here. This is the very first time I'm ever, I've ever done a product review of this sort. And I find it weird, but I also find it very awesome. So that is why I'm sharing it. Okay, so I'm going to start off with a little disclaimer here. This is for women only because we deal with menstruation every month. I've had a period since I was 13 years old. So I've had one now for 15 years. And I'm just now finding this product and I am so mad about it. I've actually researched it and heard about it for about the past three years, but I finally just went ahead and taken the plunge. It is called Soft Cups or a Diva Cup. Um, like I said, this is very weird to speak about, so please excuse me. Um, I've always had a regular period. It had the start off like bloody murder scene, taper on off and be gone by this business. And I also have the cramps and all the premenstrual symptoms that go with it. I'm a very regular period haver. Um, and I'm a very stereotypical, I guess is what you'd say. I have the cramps. I have the cravings, I have the breakouts, and I have the mood swings. Although, during my period, it's not as bad. It's that week before where you might catch me at the wrong moment, and I'm all up in here reaching for everything like you'll catch everything. You feel me? But I have to say, this is the first menstrual cycle that I've used these. And uh, let me see, where's the little picture? I can't show you because it doesn't... Okay. It's this little thing. They come individually wrapped. A Diva Cup is more permanent. Not to say it stays in there, but it's more permanent. It's, it's, these are disposable. That's the word I was looking for. Disposable little things. I think that was not good. Just, you know. Don't use it. Peel the outsides and then you'll see. Um, these, uh, if you could tell, I don't know if you've ever heard of the Nuva Ring um, birth control, but it's kind of like that, but it has a no hormones but it has a plastic little cup part so you'd open it push the cup out and then squeeze it like this and insert like a tampon so the thing is i'm normally on the first day it's super super plus depending upon because since i've had kids my flow has gotten a little bit heavier so it'll be super maybe super plus on the first day two first day to day two and then after that it's regular tampons and then I don't even use light on the last day I'll just wear a panty liner or just a pad and let it go by this business but let me tell you when I tell you that I've had the best period of my life I don't even know how how does that even sound that's good that's fine when it's too soft it's not good right not gone this was the best period of my life because of these soft cups so like when you're sitting on the toilet or whatnot, you take it inserted like a tampon and you push it back until it makes like almost like a suction thing in there. Push it back and up, like kind of up. Get it in there tight or whatnot. And you don't even have to wear a panty liner. You don't have to wear a pad. It does everything. So when I tell you that I got to sleep comfortably, when I tell you that I got to wear clothes that I normally would not wear or wear underwear that I normally would not wear, it was amazing. I just, I don't even know how I'm making this video. Like, y'all just don't even know. I don't even know how I'm making this video. And they're normally like $10 at Walgreens because I bought a pack at Walgreens before my period started. So I'm like, I'm going to try this. And I happen to be at Kroger and they had them on sale for $5.49. Do you know I bought the pack and took the other one right back to Walgreens? It was like, nah, y'all double the price. So I really got to try it out for $5. And now I will definitely either be buying me a Diva Cup or buying me some more bees. Now, let me get to the con. That is really, it won't be a con for long. I don't know how to say this without sounding kind of weird. If, <laughs> oh my gosh, I have to say these things. Okay. Depending on your wall structure, it may be uncomfortable initially, but it expands or it contracts depending upon your area's makeup. 
So initially I did it wrong. I didn't push it all the way back. So I kept feeling like it was moving and it was. So I had to take that one out and I tried it again and I got it in there right. And so once you, you know, you find that spot and you're like, okay, it's good to go. The only other thing is the removal because these are disposable. Um, you just throw them away. You cannot flush them. So you would, you know, you have to take it out. Make sure that you do not spill it. Now that's what I was saying. That's the only con because if you don't be, if you're not careful, you will spill it. But as long as you're over the toilet, you should be okay. Um, I'm just a germaphobe type person or a icky. I don't know. But um, when I remove mine, I wear a glove. Like to insert, actually, too, to insert and remove. I use a glove, one hand glove, and that way when I remove it. I just wrap the glove around it and throw it away. So it works as a sanitation, remove a sanitary removal process as well as a, um, what is it called? And, a, oh, an enclosing and, you know, disposal, disposable way. Um, so that's my only, you know, like, hey, if you, if you really just kind of not feeling that, then go ahead. But there's some women that use the tampons that don't have the plastic applicator or carbon applicator. So for you women that do that, you're definitely okay. Because you know, you deal with that. And you know, you've got that down pat. Um, but yes, this is a very new type of review for me. Uh, hope you guys liked it. And if you didn't, I'm sorry. But we all, us as women, we all deal with that. And I doubt anyone truly dislike this type of video. It's just informative. But uh, if you do, God bless your little heart. Um, so if you guys have any questions, any other questions about this, um, I'll try to reply. But if I get a lot of questions about it, I'll just make another video about it. Especially if I have the same questions repeated. Um, I'll just do a video. So thank you for staying tuned. Check the tutorial out for this look in the down bar. And thank you. See you guys later. Bye.